What is up and welcome back to day number four. Uh, once again, we're just gonna sit at home and do nothing today. No, I'm just kidding. We're going, we're going somewhere amazing today. Just to give you guys a little bit of a rundown of what we did yesterday. So we woke up, first thing, went into that two hour ATV, UTV tour. Absolutely amazing time. I had actually, I, I'd driven them a little bit, but but nothing like that. That, that type of terrain was, I don't know if you got a, a good glimpse of it from the, the videos we took, but the, t the terrain was incredible. We were out there in the middle of the desert. And then last night we went to the, uh, the Phoenix uh, Coyotes, Arizona Coyotes, sorry, game. Also amazing. They got the win in overtime. Three on three, well, four on four hockey, if you haven't had a chance to see how they play overtime. Amazing. And today we're going to somewhere that our tour guide yesterday that lives down here said is one of the 10 most beautiful places in the United States of America. So, we got a bit of a drive, let's go. Well, we made it to uh, Slide Rock State Park. So you can see behind me, beautiful, super, super clean water. Now we're in Arizona, so we're like, uh, we'll, we'll go there and swim. That's where everyone goes to swim. We're, we're a couple hours north of Phoenix, but turns out it's like 60 degrees and the water's like 30 some degrees. So we might give her a go. Not, not quite sure yet. Max might give it a go. He's tougher than both of us. What do you think? You gonna swim? For sure, but unbelievable looking place. You can actually, it's called Slide Rock Park, so I know it's shocking. You can slide down the rocks. A lot of hiking trails, beautiful red rock is what it's known for, but uh, we're gonna keep on walking around and then maybe grab some lunch and then potentially, once it warms up to 75, get in this frigid water, but maybe not for too long. But I want to, at least once. We gotta go down the slide at least once, right Max? That's a big rock, Max. Get up on top of there. How much do you think that thing weighs? 200 pounds? Try to push it over. Push it over. Make it roll down the creek. Make a dam. Also, might have to go steal our fishing rod from somebody. This looks too sexy. I don't think there's any fish. There was a trout farm station down the road a little bit, but uh, this looks amaze. Nice cliff you got there, Max. We're like five feet deep right there. God. If Dad can can't do it, no, I can't. Dad can't do it. Let's just hope he falls down. It's it's stable. It's stable. <laughs> He's going in. He's going in. <laughs> Get low. <laughs> Dad. He's alive. Make it. Strike a pose.
All right, buddy. Just push out, Max, and then swim. Hey, swim straight across, okay? I don't think I can do that. My jaw doesn't work because it's locked shut. <laughs> yep. Just push out. We'll do it. We'll do a count down. Ready, Max? That's what he did last time. Ready? Three, two, one, jump! Woo! Yeah! Good job, buddy! You're the man! A little chilly, huh? One dozen rattlesnake eggs. Whew. Keep in cool place to prevent hatching. I mean, that's that's a really good natural incubator. That manila folder there. Wait, look at this. Caution. Tape here before mailing. You don't want them to hatch and then escape, huh? Mm -hmm. Well, we just got done uh, sliding down the rocks at the slide rock and jumping off the cliff. That was the coldest my body has ever been in my entire life. I think the water was probably in the 30s. Good thing is it's a desert out here apparently so your skin dries off almost immediately when you get out of the water. But we had a really, really good time today. Max, what do you think about that water? Cold as H-E-L-L. <laughs> <laughs> you heard it here. We keep it PG on this MF and channel. But uh, unfortunately, this is the last day of our trip. I apologize if you guys were watching this video hoping to see some fishing. Next time I come to Arizona, I will absolutely be doing some fishing. And I do really, really appreciate all the guys that hit me up while I was here to do some fishing. Unfortunately, I just didn't have time. We had too many things planned, but all the things we've had planned, everything's turned out awesome. It was really, really fun. But uh, yeah, a little two and a half hour drive, then we're out of here. Hey MFers, I am obviously back home now. Amazing, amazing trip uh, to Phoenix and Arizona, the surrounding areas. I, I strongly recommend going to Slide Rock State Park, hitting up that ATV, UTV tour, going to the sporting events, Camelback Mountain. Everything we did was freaking awesome. Like I, like I just said, I'm going through this edit right now. I, I do apologize there was no fishing in this video. We, we had a jam-packed schedule, but a little family time was, was certainly in need. I do want to get back to Phoenix. I'm, I'm hoping to get there in March. I like to hit up some spring training games slash hit up some slaunch factories because I know you guys got them down there. Everyone's been hitting me up telling me how good of fishing there is down there. So definitely will be doing that going forward. But for now, I'm, uh, I'm loading up the boat right now. Kind of a mess like it always is trying to get everything ready because as you watch this i am heading south i'm either in missouri or kansas or texas or somewhere down south going to uh going down to some slaunch factories myself this next week hopefully hopefully getting some really really good content i, I want to break my new pb this trip hit that thumbs up if you want to see me break my new pb this trip um, my PB, by the way, largemouth bass, eight and a half pounds on the money. I caught it in a tournament. I, I don't know if I really have told you guys that a whole lot, but uh, yeah, hopefully getting my, my biggest bass ever this trip. I'm gonna try to teach you guys something along the way as always. And of course, we're gonna have a good time, a good MF in time. Got some beers loaded up, got the tackle loaded up. You can't go wrong 
with that. Taking Joe's rig, old Whitey, so you know, we'll be rolling on recycled oil. He's got 150 gallons of recycled oil ready to dump right into the truck. And we're gonna hit up some of the best fisheries in the country, to be honest. Some of, some of the best lakes, the hottest lakes right now in the entire United States. Super stoked, maybe even doing some collabs with some uh, some dudes. I don't know, there's a couple guys I know of that, uh, that are YouTubers that live in Texas. Maybe we could uh, collaborate with them a little bit. We'll just have to wait and see once we get down there though. But uh, thank you guys so much for taking the time to watch this video. As always, I will be back very, very soon. Probably gonna have a lot of videos coming out the next 10 days or so. So thank you guys so much. I'm out of here. Peace.